I will keep this 120 grit belt for the future final job. Now I put 80 grit for this fast job. You know, this long line grinding, fast job is needed. You can see something like a lamination line, but it's a fake line. This gray portion is just coating. And uh, as you can see, this side bevel is two meters higher than this side bevel. This side lower, this side higher, asymmetrical a bit. So, I will make a higher starting rate only on this side and uh, shallow down this deep convex. It is not a paper cutting edge at all. I always need a paper cutting edge in my preference. And uh, practically, as a buttoning wedge, even as a buttoning wedge, blue paper steel, good steel, too large. Pretty high grind. Okay. Now, this stuff is my essential tool. This one, Yomi. Bird grind. One inch. Very nice. I'm moving the angle intentionally in this range to make a convex bevel. This is not a chopper for me, just a buttoning wedge, sharp buttoning wedge. in this range, from here to here. I hope you can see this edge angle smallness compared to the initial condition. You can see the real lamination line. This line takes the coating line. I guess the coating was done using the same technique as uh, increasing the Damascus lines. Anyway, this lamination line is the one, the proof of this construction, warikomi, the core is the blue paper steel, parallel to A2 in my opinion, 220 finish.
the lamination line is more clear. After a couple of minutes on this 400 grit, Chaucer sharpened patterns appear, as you can see, and the lamination line goes very 400 finish. After 800, the patterns are finer. Okay, let's go to the final stone, 2000. This sharpening is very easy. Angle strictness is useless, very fuzzy. Hmm, like this. Easy sharpening. Like this. Actually, my hand is moving like this. Convex sharpening is very fuzzy and easy and short in time. Very short is enough. Because after this chopping, I go to stropping, black compound stropping. I don't need a mirror finish at all. The initial edge we preferring with the belt sander and uh, 120 sharp tone is essential, but this sharpening polishing process is very fuzzy, no problem at all, very easy. This is my stone finish, 2000 grit. It is okay to me. I like this sharpening pattern very much. Okay, let's go to stropping. From my experience, this finest and thinnest DLT bench strop makes the keenest edge I know This edge angle is very large. I intentionally made it maybe 28 degrees 
something like that. Just a bit less than 30. You know, I need sharpness as well as toughness for this batoning edge. Its original edge did have only toughness. I was not satisfied with this factory made edge. So I am doing this reprofiling. Anyway, finishing. Okay. This towel is a bit wet. Okay. Please look at this finished edge. Can you see that? This place is a bit dark to show you the edge condition, maybe. Anyway, this is the finished edge. See that? This angle. Convex. Can you see this convex bevel? I hope you can. Whoa. Absolutely razor edge. So Let's try batoning with it in my garage. It will be a lot of fun. How different than before. Super edge. Okay, here we go. This is the thickest wood in my collection for this long hatchet, batoning hatchet. This one. Okay, see that? This thickness. Okay. hard job even to this hatchet anyway it's a fun this button is too light this is a better button Easy batoning. I know someone can criticize me 
Anyway, we have no paper here. Let's do a paper cut test upstairs. This is the edge after the job. Took much amount of resin from the pine. That wood was pine. I don't know, <laughs> Sometimes it's my Kindle. Sometimes edge wiper. Anyway. No. No. No nix. Around here, I don't see anything, but maybe some rose. It will restore very soon. Just a moment. I will try white compound only. I hope this will restore it. Yes, restored easy edge convex. Scandi convex, so to say. My homemade Scandi convex. From my experience, I can understand what edge angle is better for each job. For this job, this angle is the nicest. I don't care about the resin. I will need to do it again soon. This is my knife care or camaria. This is my batoning wedge hatchet by Toyokuni. Thanks for watching. See you. Bye-bye.